afternoon, New Mexico is already feeling more and more earthquakes, and scientists think they know one of the big reasons why. People are causing them. One industry specifically. News 13's Haley Rush is live downtown with the answer. Haley. Kim, a new federal report says that the oil and gas drilling industry is the reason for a sharp rise in small quakes. Quakes like this are now jolting once stable regions, including parts of northern and southeast New Mexico, areas where drilling is a booming business. It's been um, a very intense uh, review of models and earthquakes over the last couple of years for the USGS. A review by the U.S. Geological Survey that landed areas like Raton to the north and Dagger Draw down south near Carlsbad on the list. Most of them are that we're, people are feeling are in that magnitude two and a half and greater range. Experts say they've known about man's ability to generate earthquakes for years. And they say the recent spike in activity is mainly caused by the oil and gas industry injecting wastewater deep underground, which can activate dormant faults. It can be a change in the stress around the fault that can unclamp the, the forces holding the fault together, overcome those, and then you get earthquakes. Researchers say the largest recorded man-made quake to shake New Mexico was a 5.2 magnitude in 2011 near the Colorado state line. And these experts say they want oil and gas companies to take notice. We're taking another step to inform the communities that might need to make decisions about um, wastewater disposal. And as the oil and gas industries keep booming in New Mexico, researchers think the small quakes will just get more frequent. We did speak with the New Mexico Oil and Gas Association, and they say it's a very important issue. However, they say that what they do for New Mexico's economy is a huge deal and that people should not overreact to this report. Kim, back to you. Okay, thanks, Haley. Now, while federal geologists believe fracking causes man-made earthquakes as well, it was not specifically looked at in this report.